customer. Wait, what's your rush, what's your hurry? You gave me such a fright, I thought you was a ghost half a minute. Can't you sit, sit you down, sit. All I meant is that I haven't seen a customer for weeks. Did you come here for a pie, sir? Do forgive me if me head's a little vague. Oh, what is that? But you think we had the plague from the way that people keep avoiding? No, you don't. Heaven knows I try, sir. But there's no one comes in even to inhale. Right you are, sir. Would you like a drop of ale? Mind you, I can hardly blame them. These are probably the worst pies in London. I know why nobody cares to take them. I should know. I make them. But good now. The worst pies in London, even that's polite. The worst pies in London, if you doubt it, take a bite. Is that just disgusting? You have to concede it. It's nothing but crusting. Here, drink this, you'll need it. The worst pies in London, and no wonder with the price of meat what it is when you get it. Never thought I'd live to see the day. Men would think it was a treat, finding poor animals what was dying in the street. Mrs. Mooney has a pie shop, does a business, but I noticed something weird. Lately all her neighbor's cats have disappeared. Have to hand it to her, what I calls enterprise, popping pussies into pies, what and do in my shop. Just the thought of it's enough to make you sick. And I'm telling you, them pussy cats is quick. No denying times is hard, sir. Even harder than the worst pies in London. Only lard and nothing more. Is that just revolting or greasy and gritty? It looks like it's molting and tastes like, well, pity a woman alone. We wind and the worst pies in London oh sir times is hard times is hard